السلام علیکم اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم قال اللہ في القرآن الكریم ایاک نعبد و ایاک نستعین صدق اللہ علیہ العظیم So welcome uh, to this training program and on behalf of Diet, I thank my teacher, Mr. Yusuf Saab, and also coordinator who is here, Mr. Aslam Saab, and my friend, Mr. Muzamil Saab. And I would like to say that when I came here first time, I was told by Aslam Saab that it's now Phoenix because we have to change everything now. So for teachers, this is really the training program. But I would say that later we'll talk about it much more. But before that, I'll go for knowledge of previous what we call. So yesterday, what we studied here, what we got here, the training about, we'll see that. So shall we start, sir? with your permission. Okay. Yeah, that's great. Now, so I, I would like to say first that how many songs are there? 24, 24 songs. And these 24 songs are divided into two groups. Can you name? Wall songs. Yeah, it's wall songs and consonant songs. Consonant songs. Wall songs and consonant songs. How many wall songs are there? 20. 20 wall songs. Very good. And how many consonants consonant songs are there? 24. Wall songs are divided into two groups. Can you name? Monotongs and diphthongs. Very good. Monotongs and diphthongs. How many monotongs are there? 12 are monotongs and 8 are diphthongs. 8 are diphthongs. And my story was something different. That was a bit, I would say, the part of training program. Can you narrate the story? And I would say, I am a shepherd. I am a shepherd. And I have sheep. I went to sheep. And what I saw there, I saw their bed. And the what was bed made of? Bamboo. bamboo. Very good. Bed was made of bamboo. And what I saw on the bed? Pot. There was a pot. There was a pot. pot. What was in the pot? Shanti or salt. And it was added by Mr. Irshad Saab. Thank you for this. And Shanti was there. What I did with Shanti? Caught. I caught Shanti. I caught Shanti in boot. And I? Cut, cut, cut boot, boot and I gave it to bird. bird. And bird was unconscious. unconscious and then I put, put, I put, I put the bird, the bird uh, in cupboard. Uh, then yeah. then was the story about diphthongs. What was that? No now. No now. now. Make a boy. Make, make a boy. white boy yes. here yeah. or yeah. there. Yeah. Reach yeah. Or yeah. Now, from this evaluation, I will say only the words and you'll say the song. She. E. 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 Very good. Ship. E. 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 Very good. Bamboo. E. 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 Pot. O. 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 Shanti. O. O. Caught. O. 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 Caught. O. O. Boot. O. Cut. O. Bird. O. Put. Cupboard. Uh, 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 very good. Now, note. Oh. Oh. Note. Oh. Now. Oh. Make. A. 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 Very good. A. A. Bite. A. A. Boy. A. A. Here. Here. There. A. There. A. There. A. Rich. That's the story. Poor. 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 Very good. These are 20 well sums. These are 20 well sums. Now. Uh, now, I will uh, just go for this. I will write transcription of the word. You have to recognize the word. For example, I will say here, what's this? Re. Is it re? Re. Is it S sound or A? A. What's that? Re. 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 What's this? Rick. Very good. Rick. 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 If I say like this, if Rick. I don't put here two dots, Rick. 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 And if I say like this, Rick. Rick. very good. Now, another word. 
Frau. Frau. Very good, it's Frau. Now. Frau. Very good, Frau. Frau. Very good, Frau. Frau. Then. Now, those. Uh, one more word, this was evaluation, then we'll take another lesson. That's this. Mm -hmm. Me. <coughs> Be allowed a bit. Milli. 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 Military. 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 So, based on these sounds, based on these, these sounds, sounds, we have another lesson today. That's weak form. That's weak form. form. See, weak form, say weak form, weak form. and strong form. Strong form. Weak form, weak form, and strong form. And strong form. Do you know we have helping verbs? Do you know? Yes. 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 And how helping verbs help us? They help our man verbs. They help our man, man verbs. verbs. We have the helping verbs of present. We have first the present. And we have the helping verbs of past. past. And we have the helping verbs of future. future. So tell me, how many helping verbs are there? We have helping verbs for, for present. present. Past. Helping verbs for past. Helping verbs for future. future. Let's take helping verbs for the present tense. Very good. But I write here weak form, and I write here strong form. Now, what's weak form? When you want to communicate, when you want to increase your fluency, when you want to communicate in day-to-day -day language, we use there always, that's weak form, that's weak form. And if you open the dictionary, we always see there strong form of helping verbs, strong form of helping verbs. One good example first, we'll take example here, that is, if this is now, this is, this is, is, this is, is. And it's strong form, when you open the dictionary, the strong form of it is like this. This is a sound, and this is the, the sound. sound. So it becomes is. is. This is a strong form. And these are two work heels here, slanting bars. Slanting bars. Now, let's see what's the weak form of it, and how it will help us in communication, in communication process. Now see, <coughs> this is the. This is only the sound. This is only the, the sound. sound. Let's see, can you read this? Because we know the symbols now. This is her sound. And this is E sound. What's this? He. He. Very good. Read aloud. He. He. And you put here the sound. It becomes his. 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 It becomes his. his. It becomes his. his. So you can say he's going. He's going. going. He's writing. He's right. writing. He's playing. He's playing. playing. He's washing. He's washing. He's calling. He's calling. calling. Now, you don't need to say he is calling because in day to day language, what Britishers do, they always use weak form. They always use weak form. form. So weak forms, they will increase your fluency. They will increase your fluency. Yes. Now, another one in present. Can you say that in verb? It is for singular. And now we have R. Uh, very good. This is? Now, we'll see first the strong form. That is this. And I'll put in bracket this rep sound because you can read it or you can leave it there. So this is a strong form. So we can? Uh, uh, very good. This is? Uh, R. This is? Uh, R. R. So neutral lips, you don't have to round your lips. This is R. R. This is R. R. Now see, it's weak form. Uh, this is uh, 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 R. You can read it like this if you are American, or if you want to beautify this word, you can read R. You can read uh, R. So I write here, I write here, this is the sound. This is. Now can you read this? A sound with it? Yeah? They, aloud, please they, aloud. They. They. <coughs> they. Now, I will put here. They. 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 
is the separate here. They, there, 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 they are going there, going. They don't need to say now. They are going. They are going. Be attentive. You, you have to stand and make you stand and you have to say yourself then. They are. They are. So this is for R. Is its weak form in communication process. Again, how to learn these weak forms? Like I did say. Uh, yesterday that when you are in the room you make one room laboratory for you and you paste charts on the walls and then write words new words you see in the dictionary you write those words this is the best technique you write these words on those charts and when you go inside your laboratory you make conversation only for 10 minutes with these words first you have to say the words aloud you have to pronounce them for example there are 10 words this is alarm this is uh, category, this is secretariat, this is animal, this is military, this is private, this is balloon, this is commander, this is uh, jasmine, uh, whatever the words are. You pronounce them, then make your short paragraphs with those words, illogical or logical. You, the words you have said, for example, I met a commander there in the military uh, picket and then I went to forest and we saw their animals, different animals, uh, tiger was there, lion was there, on the gate there was a peon, I told peon that I want to go inside, this is way to make practice of words, same is the case here with these weak forms, you have to make chart, then you have to write on the chart, he chart, he chart, then you have to say he's, then you have, you have to connect it with the uh, verb, then he's going, he's going. going. She's going, she's going. going. Now, for he, it's his, and this is she, this is he. It becomes she, she. she. and now put this, she, she's. she's. <coughs> this is she's. she's, because this is the weak form. form. So this was for R. Now, which helping word is there uh, in present? Is, is, is there already? Um, yeah, very good. This is? And now see first the strong form. This is strong form. M. This M. is M. This is M. M. And now the weak form is, it's only this. M. This only M sound. M sound. Very good. This is M sound. Now, let's see I. Let's see I. I. The phonetic transcription of this is I. I. This is I. I. Or you can see like this. It's I. I. Now put this here. It becomes I. 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 This I. becomes I. I. I'm going. I'm going. going. I'm writing, I'm, writing. I'm listening, I'm eating. So you don't have to pronounce the sound at the end. Now this is I'm. Now which one is there helping verb? Very good. Yeah? First is has for singulars. This is H A S. Let's see the strong form in dictionary what we have. That's this. So pronounce it. It's has. It's has. Let's see its weak form. Let's see its Weak form. form. The weak form is it's like this z or us. Z or us. Often we do complain here when foreigners do speak, they speak grammatically incorrect. This is incorrect statement. It's their language, they are native speakers, so it's impossible that they will speak grammar. They will speak grammar with incorrect grammar. Likewise, I would say whenever we do speak Kashmiri, we speak with good accent we speak with good grammar when we speak Kashmiri same is the case with foreigners see what they do here when it's the sound for has and us for this has see now he so how can you read it now he's gone he's gone, he's gone. gone. So it looks that he did say he is gone. He is yes, gone. You are saying that this is wrong. This is wrong. wrong. But he has used this weak form here in the spoken uh, language that is he's, he's gone. gone. He's gone. 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 Power's gone. Power's gone. Uh, power and z sound. Power's gone. Power's gone. 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 So he's gone. And if you are a formal speaker on days, you are on days and you are speaking formally and you can say he is gone. He is gone. gone. Otherwise you can say he is gone. He is gone. gone. So it's like this z sound for is and z sound for has. So what's another helping word there? Very good. This is H-A-V-E. Let's see first the strong form of it. This is? This is? This is? And let's see its weak form. weak form. That's this. This is v. This v. is v. v. Or this is this. 
Oh. 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 Or? Oh. Oh. Now, tell me the verb, tell me the subject. Tell me the subject. If you have the subject here, for example, this is your subject. This is they. This is they. the and a. T-H-E-Y. This is they. And you put a sound here, it becomes they. 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 Yeah, that's they. So they want. They gone. gone to market. They have gone to market. market. You can say they have gone to market, or you can say they have gone to market. So there is no need to say they have gone to market. They have gone to market. They have gone to canal. They have gone to canal. They have gone to restaurant. They have gone to restaurant. So this is they. This is they. they. This is have. This is has. This is a, this is R, this is is, and what's now there? No, it's very good. Huh. It's also helping verb, V E E N. V E E N. It's always in strong form or weak form, always whenever you speak, you speak it always big. You speak it always big. So it's big. So when it's with has, it becomes as been or zabin. For example, we'll say, he has been uh, digging for the last two hours. He's been digging for the last two, two hours. hours. So I didn't say he has been. He has been. Instead of he has been, been digging for the last two hours. hours. So with plural subject, they. With plural subject, they. When we say have been, have been, we can say they've been. They've been working or they've been writing since morning. They've been writing since morning. It's like this. Yes. So, have been is always a been or a been. Have been is a been or a been. Have is a, have is, uh, has is us. Uh, Let's evaluate and let you read also. Now read it. Is, 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 is read aloud. Is, 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 is z, 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 r, 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 m, 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 has, has, Z, 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 how, how, what, what, oh, 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 been, 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 wrongly, been, 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 been always. So this was for present. This was for present. present. Now see, what are weak forms? Can you say now? Weak forms are. Weak forms are. Yeah, please. Yeah, weak forms are. This is a weak form. Is a kind of. Pronunciation, the way to pronounce these helping verbs. These helping okay. verbs when you are in when you are using English as a spoken language. Spoken language. language. And its strong form is the pronunciation you see in the dictionary. dictionary. You see in dictionary. dictionary. So here, this is weak form in communicative process. In communicative process. process. So in present, how many helping verbs are there? You can read helping verbs. Can you say? Yeah? Is, is, uh, is are, uh, and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, and what's the weak form of is? The, the, what's the weak form of are? Uh, 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 what's the weak form of has? The, the or? Uh, 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 the uh, or? Uh, uh, what's the weak form of have? Uh, 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 and what's the weak form of has been? Been. Has been. Has been. Has been. been. And what's the weak form of have been? Have uh, 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 been. And webin. Webin or? So you have to make chart. You have to make what chart. we call he chart. You will see first he is or he is, then he has, then he has been. This is he chart. Then you have to write sentences, then you have to make practice. Then you have to make practice. So there, this was all about uh, weak forms in present. And in next lecture, we'll see weak forms in uh, past wow. and then weak forms in future. future. Weak forms in future. future. So see you in our next lecture. Till then, goodbye. Thank you.